everybody. So today is Monday. That means it's time for a family movie night. And this week, we're continuing on my month-long series of underrated Disney films. And we are talking about Alexander and the Terrible, Horrible, No Good, Very Bad Day. And if you listened to my uh, Talking Disney episode where we we're ranking the Disney films from 2014, you'd hear that I quite enjoyed this film very much. I had it, I think, at number four for that year amongst Disney films. And I wasn't expecting to like it because I love the book and the book is very sweet and simple. And I think it has a really emotionally true message of that, you know, anybody can have a bad day and, and uh, it's possible, like we're always telling kids they just need to be cheerful all the time and they can't uh, be sad and frustrated and have normal human emotions. Uh, and I think that that book does a really good job of validating what kids feel. And so when I saw the trailer, I thought, oh, they're just turning this sweet, simple, emotionally true story into this, into this slapstick comedy. And I was annoyed. But then I actually saw the movie and I thought that it was really funny and it surprised me. And it doesn't have quite the same message of the book, but I think it still has a really nice message about family, that every person in the family matters and that everybody is valuable and uh, we should take care of each other a little bit more. And it tells the story of this, this boy, Alexander, who has a terrible day and he's very frustrated by his friends, by his family. Uh, by the fact that uh, he isn't in Australia, <laughs> all these different things. And so he, when he blows his uh, birthday cake out, he wishes that his family would also have a very, very bad day. And everything seems to be going right in, in all of the family members' life. But when the curse starts, everything goes wrong. And uh, I think what makes this movie so strong is the the great cast I mean, of course you got Steve Carell Jennifer Garner as the parents that's perfect and I really love Dylan Minnette as his older brother uh, and my favorite scene of the whole movie is when he goes to get his driving test and Jennifer Coolidge plays the driving instructor and she is hilarious as usual she's always funny but I just think this scene is so funny and I remember just being so stressed out taking my driver's test and just hoping that I would pass and and this one I just think is so funny. Hey Celia, yeah, I can't really talk right now. But Put I... the phone down. What? Put the mobile device down now. No, but... Hey eyes on the road. <laughs> and and not every kind of joke lands, but enough do that I think it works. There's a really funny thing about an escaped kangaroo. There's a funny thing about the thunder down under. <laughs> which is hilarious uh, and you know all the all the family members having their version of the worst day ever and then Alexander starts to realize that he loves his family doesn't want them to be uh, in pain anymore and <laughs> it's very very sweet uh, so if you like these kind of family comedies then I think you'll really enjoy this I, I do think that it's quite underrated and at the time, Disney just was not making these kind of movies. So it was so refreshing. Now they're making some more of them like Timmy Failure, uh, but we still could use even more. I love family comedies. I love watching comedies with my family. And uh, I think we need more live action family comedies like Alexander and the Terrible, Horrible, No Good, Very Bad Day. They don't all need to have such long titles though. <laughs> but... This is a funny movie. It's a sweet movie. It would be a great one to watch all together and have some nice discussions for your family home evening about uh, being honest and working together and valuing everybody's experience. Uh, so I think that would be a great, great time uh, as a family. So let me know what you think of this one. Do you like it, not like it? Do you agree that it's underrated or maybe you didn't like it at all? I would love to hear your thoughts in the comments section. Uh, please like this video. Please subscribe to my channel. I appreciate it so much. And we also have the patron group, which helps support do, me doing what I do. And it's only $2 a month to join. And I would just be so grateful. Uh, we also have the merch store, which has hashtag animation junkie shirts. So please take a look at that. And thanks so much, everybody. We'll talk to you later. Bye.